The 25th of October marks the anniversary of the peak of the 2019 protest in Iraq. Um, at the time, that asked for better employment opportunities and uh, quality public service. Um, this day will be marked also by the mourning of the more than 600 protesters who were killed back then. Uh, protesters will convene on Tahrir Square in Baghdad and other southern cities like Nasiriyah and Basra. Um, this comes in actually quite a unique context two weeks after the parliamentary elections and uh, just while the government's being formed, putting the country in a sort of political limbo. Um, the protesters' demands haven't been met, uh, which makes this context quite volatile. Um, some protesters have told us actually that they're worried that some par par paramilitary groups um, will actually cause a disturbance, blocking roads and leading to confrontations. Uh, these groups have actually been um, quite enraged by the fact that the, the parties they support have lost a lot of seats and have been protesting daily since the election. Um, this context actually makes it quite difficult to understand what's going to happen in Baghdad.